Imagine a Christmas without chicken. As ridiculous as it is sound, please do note that some families can't even afford a chicken at Christmas. And that is what we have decided to help out with. As great The journey started as early as 15 minutes to 7 in the morning. Immediately we landed at the venue where we planned to share the little that we got. Surprisingly, a lot of persons were waiting for us as early as 6 a.m. in the morning. And I tell you, it's so beautiful to see these loving faces, families, that have the mindset that they are going to get something for Christmas from the Cetros Foundation. Uh, no. And while we help to rebag and rearrange so that the little food stuff we have can go round, we are proud to say we have enough chicken yeah. to cover for about a hundred families. But the food stuff we just have to make do with what we have and by the time I got out a lot of persons were out there the number was just growing every minute more people are flooding in uh, so I had to lecture them on how we need to comport ourselves and the fact that we needed to get their numbers and they should tell us any of their children that might need empowerment so that come next year they will be able to take care of the families. Now, please, as you come, you already put it in the computers. We might not have the money to buy food stuff for everybody, but everybody will go with chicken. But there are some persons that the few that we are able to give chicken and food stuff so that nobody will say they are doing pasha with we plan ourselves like that. The main thing is that after you leave here, before you leave here, make sure you collect the number so that your children or your sister or your brother that want to learn something to do and you do not have money to sponsor that person. Don't, don't let that person stay like that. You will pay for the training. Wherever they want to do the training, that's not our own business. The stuff is that the boy or the girl must be serious. Wow, it's so nice to have these numbers of people, beautiful people, just coming, collecting, smiling, having the opportunity to eat chicken on the Christmas day. I tell you, this is beautiful. Okay. Watching me and my family this season, may God bless all of you. Your course, you never drop, drop, and you continue touching people to the end of your life in Jesus' name. Okay. Thank you. Just need to see the joy on the faces of those people. They were so happy that at least someone is thinking about them. Be a family to these people. All we just need to be looking for is that smiles coming from their side, even to those that could not handle the live chicken. I tell you in Africa, live chicken on Christmas Day is the most interesting gift you can ever think of. And we are so happy to be part of this. This is interesting. We appreciate our supporters on this channel. We appreciate all those that have contributed to help our community. 
please don't just think of yourself think of your immediate community and what you can do to put smiles on their face after numerous hours of sharing we discovered that more people were still coming but we were already running out of stock so what we just had to do was to provide for as many that we could take care of and just hope that come next year we'll be able to plan bigger if we are starting with 100 families this year we are definitely sure by next year god will help us so that we can do thousands of families just in a gp because once we think about it then we'll have the opportunity to pull these miles back to the community to the community where it belongs these are the people the highway cleaners that are doing a very very dangerous risky jobs they are out as early as 5 a.m in the morning yet their payments their salaries cannot take care of anything so we consider them the most whenever they come around we just leave all the people on the queue and attend to them first because these Loma people they are the best set that has been keeping the whole city clean and this is just a little way we could assist and everybody complied when we decided to answer them and at the end of the day the remaining food stuff that we have we have to share it in bits we have to even open the nylon you know just people that can take the granite oil people that can pepper just and it was fun this is how we spent our christmas not thinking about ourselves but others thank you mm-hmm.